Alright guys, so I'm back with another video here and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to test your thermal cutoff switch. It's very simple but it can cause big issues with your dryer not heating. And that's the most important part of dryer right there. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and shoot up a picture real quick of what this looks like on the back of a dryer and where it's exactly located at. They're all basically a the same on some models it's different but most standard common dryers are all going to be located in the same spot all right so what we're going to go ahead and do now is we're going to grab our multimeter and a lot of them's different some of them's the same if you have a beep setting with the sound you can turn it to it or you can also turn it to the ohm setting i'm going to just show you both real quick so what we're going to go ahead and do So now that we've got it on ohms, grab, grab your two leads, and with these you can just kind of stick them in those little holes right there. I'm trying to get it rocking, get them in here and hold it. Pick that phone up to show you the reading real quick. So let me pick this up real quick. We'll do it this way. So you can see I've got both of the leads on there. And as long as you're getting a reading, you're good. The screen on. You can see that it's getting a reading. So one other way we can do it is we can turn our multimeter to the sound and pretty much with a lot of these fuses you can do them the same way you can put them on the sound to see if it's working or not and as soon as you touch both sides you'll get a beat and you'll know it's good all right thank you for watching be sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you're not subscribed already for more at-home appliance testing and repair done yourself.